charge, Mr. Cranky Pants. <laughs> and check this out. A solar power charger. It uses the sun's energy to charge you back up. Cool, solar power charger. Let's go here. Yes, it works. You're charging up. And I'm getting a mega double chalk cone with infinity sprinkles. Yes! Ah, solar power recharge. Time. Take us time. Ta da! Oh, Cosmo. Charge complete. <gasps> Where's Mo? Yikes, Cosmo! We're stuck! No! Glad you're here! Kumo's getting the next coding word from our pal, Cosmo. Woohoo! Don't forget to breathe, Kumo. <laughs> Excuse me, most embarrassed. Here you go, Joanna. The words are charge and recharge. Thanks, Kimo. Charge and recharge. Those are two great words that I got from my friend Cosmo. There. That's good timing. Kimo has run out of power and is now recharging. That means putting energy back into their batteries. Two great words that I got from my friend Cosmo there. Did I miss something? <laughs> I was just saying how you run on batteries. Yay! Batteries are terrific because it means our devices don't have to be plugged in all the time to get power. Right, which means we can move them around and go anywhere. But Joanna, why do they run out of power? Why don't they last forever? Well, when batteries run out of power, we say they lose charge. Let me show you. <laughs> This bucket of water is to show how your battery works. But there are different types of batteries. Correct, Amundo. Some batteries for things like clocks, torches, and remote controls can only be used once, then they have to be recycled. But some batteries, like mine, can be used again and again. We use those rechargeable batteries in phones, tablets, and even electric cars. For them to work, we need to fill them with power or charge them up again and again. And that means recharging! Now, you need to keep real batteries away from water. This is just to help me explain. My pretend battery here is charged up with water. So if I turn the device on... The power flows through the device, making it work. If we leave this device switched on, the power runs down. And the bucket or battery is nearly empty. 
right. So I need to recharge the bucket with more power. Water on, Kimo. You got it, Joanna. Lots and lots and lots and lots of power. I'm really glad you said that, Kimo, because we get to show something else about charging batteries. Right, we've got to stop now, Cubes, because a battery can only store up so much power. Water off. Huh. And now it's recharged. The battery is ready to power our device again. I want it to go faster. It doesn't work like water that. On! Let's charge and recharge. For more coding fun, check out our playlist and the, the links below. Joanna, have you had a shower? Cosmo and friends. <laughs>